For those of you who don't know, my name is Jay Chapman. For those of you who don't recognize me, for the past 30 years, I've had a privilege of uh, serving as the director of the Growing Growth Nature Center, where I've met and come to know more than a generation of Canton and <coughs> students. And I think it's fair to say that most children do enjoy nature and the outdoors, but there are some, or some however, nature of animals hold a special place in our hearts and every once in a while one of the special ones comes along. They're easily identified because when they're outside or when they visit the nature center, they're the ones who are always smiling. And Mia was sort of one of the children. Penny, Penny reminded me the other day that Mia had her first birthday party at the nature center when she was two years old. I have to say I don't remember that much about that party. Uh, I thank God uh, for doing that. Because when parents expose their children to nature at a very young age, they early on develop a sense, a certain sense of wonder about uh, with respect to the natural world. And for Mia certainly did have that. Um, Mia and her sister Ella have had quite a few parties at the Nature Center over the years. And in fact, Mia took a lot of classes there as well. She's she was artistic and she studied the art of nature. And she was one of those, those special children who just loved everything about it. In fact, I can't think of anything that he didn't like. Um, she was particularly fond of being drunk and archie chilling. So no one could remind me that she didn't like the snakes. So my question is how do we honor the dark bright legacy? How do we honor her going forward? On some deeper level, my own feeling is that by exposing your children and your grandchildren to the natural world, you help them prepare them so that they'll be able to make decisions that they're going to inevitably have to make as adults going forward. That's down the road, I don't really want to get into that part now. But, but for now, what I'd like all of you adults to do is take your children outdoors for a walk on a beautiful fall day on the holy just at the feet. I'll bet like Mia, they'll be smiling, and so will you. And I think that's, from my perspective, a nice legacy, and that's a leg out of them. Rachel Mannis, one of Mia's friends, will offer memories of Mia. Um, I was given the honor of taking her out uh, to 
Because hers is a way to celebrate. 